I want to follow Stella Maxwell. You guys are so lucky. You get to follow her all morning. It's like <laughs> my dream. All morning. All morning. Good morning, Vogue. This is Stella Maxwell, and today we are going to the Vivian Westwood show in Paris. And I need to get ready, so come on in. I came from London, but before that, I came from LA like three, four days ago. So the jet lag's being real. But I have my eye patch mask on. I'll probably do a little bit of rolling just to help me kind of wake up. I think taking time for skincare is so important before a show because we know that there's gonna be a lot of makeup. I like to just keep it simple and I use mainly products that are fragrance free because I have quite sensitive skin. Deodorant, very important. That's really it. Both my parents are from Belfast, so I have a British passport and an Irish passport. I also was born in Belgium and I also grew up in New Zealand, so I've traveled a lot. My dad was um, a diplomat for a few years, so that's why we shifted to New Zealand. Then I started working and traveling myself, so I feel like I've constantly, pretty much my whole life, been traveling. <laughs> I think I'm wearing these pants, which are actually men's. And maybe this corset. I'm gonna add this blazer, just because it's a little cold in Paris. I was thinking to wear heels, but I don't know. Seeing as the heels in the show today are gonna be mega high, very Vivian Westwood. So call time is 10 a.m., it's 9.30. Let's go grab a coffee and we'll run to the show. Yes. <gasps> Hi. This is the makeup artist extraordinaire, Hung. I love you. Bye. Bye. My first castings. I was probably terrified and so young. You learn quickly in this industry of how to take the good and the bad, the yeses and the noes, and you get quite used to it and it's not really a big deal. Advice I would give to younger models just starting is be yourself, dress exactly how you want to dress. Staying true to yourself is so important, especially for designers to kind of see your personality, right? And just have fun with it. If you're not having fun, then what's the point? When I started modeling, we had no social media. It was so different. It was much more about, very much more physical, how tall you are, your measurements, stuff like that. And I think now they'll more cast you on your personality and how you kind of live your daily life and how girls love that and appreciate that and aspire to that. And, you know, it's a bit more meaningful for models now, I think. You just have a bit more opportunity to have a voice and, you know, you have your own platform. Okay, guys, it's 10 a.m. Time to go to the show, come on. Vivian West was so iconic and such a great designer. I've been obsessed with her, her designs for so long and I genuinely love buying the clothes. So it's always a pleasure to, you know, walk for designers that you're kind of a fan of. I just found this picture, this is a great picture. It's one of my favorite pictures in a Vivian Westwood outfit. Balancing your work life and personal life is definitely a challenge. One of my best friends was getting married in Morocco. She'd sent me the invite well in advance. I knew the dates. I had flights on hold. I was ready to go and I wanted, I was gonna be a bridesmaid. And last second, a job came up and I had to miss it. It's disappointing to miss really important moments for your friends, for your family, but you have this career for a certain amount of time. If you wanna just take every opportunity, you have to kind of um, really go for it. Good morning, Stella. Good morning. 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 Good you return, exit on the left side. Because the shoes are so high, the trick is don't cross your feet. Walk very straight with your feet. Quite a simple walk. It's 
up onto this platform. Then we stop for two seconds. And this will be the camera that will take the picture for Vogue runway. And then you will turn this way, three seconds on this side. And then you walk off and turn right. And then turn left. So these are the boot heels, which are actually easier than some of the others. You can see they're very high. Sexy. How are the stairs with the shoes? Hard. Oh gosh. Ah! We're gonna rehearse. I try to really meditate right before I walk out there because even if you fall, you've gotta just laugh and get up and it's not a big deal. It's Vivian Westwood. This one's gonna be fun. This will be my look. Amazing. I love it. Thank you so much. Hi, Queen. Check out this look. This is, this is, let's say hi to Vogue. Here. Hi, Vogue. <laughs> hi, Vogue. I was fitted with these ones, but they've swapped me out with flats, so she got lucky. We are going back into hair and makeup and then it'll be showtime. I've been playing at Handy Cards so much lately, it really like relaxes me. <laughs> Almost showtime, we're finishing up makeup and it's about to happen. We're down to the wire. Makeup! So this is my final look. What do we think? So remember, for the show, when you go on the platform, everybody is turning left. For the finale, you will go on both sides on the platform. You will wait for the designer to come. He will say hi to everybody, and then you can leave on both sides of the platform. One and go. Stella's 
Yeah, you want to sit on your hair? Yes, you got a second look. Thank you for watching My Diary of a Model, and I hope you enjoyed the shows. Thank you.